Hey guys, it's Patoon Gal, and we are back over in Planet Zoo on our Heartland Zoo. Um, I have this weird thing where whenever I'm moving the mouse, it's making a weird noise. I don't know if you guys can hear that in the the video, but that's that's weird. Okay, so um, I went ahead and made a couple of changes. Um, I don't know if it'll be super uh, obvious, but the one that is will be um, I did move the the terrain away from the habitat barrier. So we've got uh, if we go down, I don't know if we can go down this. Let's go down here. Oh, Q for Q for down, E for up. <laughs> and uh, I went ahead and did that so um, it would look more like we're underwater here. So let me know what you guys think about that. Um, I know it's still, it's kind of hard to see, uh, but it looks better to me than the, uh, where it just didn't look like you were underwater at all. Um, and you know, when they get up here close, you can definitely see them. And that's one of the reasons I wanted to make it more of a shallow, um, I don't think, it, I don't think shallow is the word, but not as deep uh, into the back here. And I did go ahead and smooth out this. So there's some of these that need to be kind of moved around a little bit. Um, let's see, we'll just move those up here. So, wow, it is super loud underwater. Like it's got, I don't know. So yeah, we did that. And let me know what you guys think. If you guys like it better with the uh, look that it's not underwater and you can see everything clearly or this look, um, you can see this area. I don't know. There's, there's random areas that you can see a lot better than others. Is that feeder? Oh, for some reason I thought the feeder was like messed up. I don't know. So, and then I smoothed out a couple of areas that were just a little too crazy, I think. So, yeah. Um, and I had to add these rocks, even though the water's like right here. It was saying that they couldn't get, um, they couldn't get in the water. So, I don't know why, but, you know, that's fine. So, we added these. Let's go ahead and I'm going to see about just moving these around. Um, we'll go ahead and just copy that. Um, I wonder, we'll just go ahead and duplicate. I was going to just try to do control X to bring them out in the same direction, but I think we'll just do it this way. I don't want it to be, um, like super similar, but if we take it and just kind of copy as we go um and move things around a little bit it shouldn't look too similar um well i say that but i do kind of need to keep the i don't know we'll try to move it around after we we get in how about that because we'll also kind of bury it into the uh ground so it won't look as uh similar let's go ahead and move this around here because I want to have them uh, I want to give them a little bit more area to be able to get into the water instead of uh, just that one area of rock <laughs> although like I said I don't know why it's doing that because they used to be fine with the amount of um, land here to get into the water but I don't know it's weird so let's go ahead I'll just try to copy I don't know a little bit less maybe I don't know if I did less, but there we go. <laughs> um, I don't think it looks too similar because it is kind of buried into the ground. So I think we're good there. And I may go ahead and move. I think I'm going to go ahead and move these out just a little bit. Not that. Okay, let's go ahead and move these over. Let's say about there. And I wonder... Um, if we want to do this, if we want to move this like that, so there's a little bit of an area to get to it. I think I like that. We'll leave it like that. And I kind of want them overlapping a little bit, but 
not too much. Apparently that interfered with something there, but that's okay. All right. I want to use these. Let's see. We'll go ahead and do um, X. So obviously we don't want it all the way up there. We want it down here. And let's see. Do we want it that? Let's do about there, I think. And we'll go under the water here. Just, that is so loud. Just to make sure that, I think it's just loud on my headphones. I hope it's not loud for the video. All right. And we'll go ahead. Nope, nope, nope. We'll go ahead and do this. I just want to make it go down, but not too far. And that should be good enough, right? Well, it's kind of in the plant, so let's go ahead and select both of these. I'm just going to drag over that. And we'll, this one we will do this control X or advanced move thing. And let's see, we'll bring it over here. Oops. They are just swimming around like crazy. I like it. Um, I don't know. That looks... Looks like we should do something else with that. I don't know. Just, uh, again, if you want to subtract from the selection, just uh, hit Control. And if you want to add to the selection, hit um, Shift. So that works out pretty good. And I was thinking about maybe moving it to over here as well. I don't know. Is that the same height? No, it's not. Although, I could make a little fence here. Maybe we'll do that. I'm just going to take this because I don't think we need to... I don't think we need to make it go further down. I think it's pretty, pretty good where it is. I kind of so. like to use this, but... Let's see. X... Let's go ahead and turn on angle snap by hitting space bar. We will have it, I think, did that go the right way? I don't know. Let's go ahead and hit X. Uh, I'm gonna move it, toggle it to the world axis. Oh gosh, no, that is not right. <laughs> that is not right at all. Uh, one, one, no. It's not what I want to do. Okay, we'll move this one. Okay, so what I think we'll probably end up doing is just moving the, um, I want to say pillars closer together. So let's see. We'll go ahead and make it, nope, not that. I don't even know if this is the right angle. Oh, I think it is. I think it'll work. All right. Okay, so there we go. Uh, okay. And uh, unfortunately, this may be somewhat of a shorter video because it looks like I'm having lots of issues keeping uh, staying online. So this may be a shorter video than I wanted it to. But um, yeah, it'll be fine. We'll We'll get this done and see what else we can do before... We go. I want to get some education boards, and I need to see what the um, protesters are protesting. But we'll do that. Let's see. And I can't change. Okay. I was just looking to see if I could change the color of that, but it doesn't look like I can. Okay. I like so, that it's control to un unselect something, but then again, it's it'll also select it. I don't like it. It's annoying. I don't think I can select that rock. Okay. Seriously. Let me select that rock. That is not annoying at all. There we go. <laughs> uh, 
you got to just get in the exact right spot. Okay. So let's see if I can do this now. Uh, shift. Okay. <laughs> Go ahead and move these over like that. And I don't think I want to add this everywhere. Oh, that is so cute with the, with the seal laying on the, on the, uh, dock like that. Oh my goodness. Hold on. I'm going to pause it. <laughs> That's just so cute. Okay. Sorry. I got sidetracked. I had to get a picture. <laughs> So, um, yeah, I don't think I'm going to have, like, rope going all the way around. I just wanted to have it go along the side. So, kind of, like, if keepers wanted to get on here, this would give them a little bit of a, um, a barrier, I guess. I don't know. It's probably not necessarily needed, but I thought it would be kind of cool. Uh, I don't go for, like, re like, total realism in the zoo. Um... I don't really want to have to have to deal with that. <laughs> That's a whole nother game altogether. But some people do play this game that way. So, which is cool. I, I love it. I just, I don't think I would be able to do it. These, and I kind of like them just as the color they are. Um, oh, let's go ahead and hit space bar to take off that angle snap. We don't need that. Yeah, so I think I'm probably going to keep it the, the color it is. Um, I don't know. Let me know what you guys think. I can always change the color uh, as as we go if we want to change um, it. So because of the issues I'm having staying on the server, staying on the, you know, the franchise server, we'll probably just make this a... A real time episode, and then we'll probably have to come back and do another one. I'm guessing because uh, I really wanted to get this habitat done in this one, but it doesn't seem like it's going to happen. So, <laughs> sorry about that, but you know, you do what you can, right? I just don't like that you can't like get the um, the terrain closer to the barrier kind of annoying but that's okay this will make it look a little bit kind of like it's supposed to be there like all these rocks are supposed to be there I hope okay so let's do bring it down a little bit yeah let's do that oh that looks like different colors actually or is that because it's underwater might be because it's underwater. All right, so we'll do that. And I think that'll be good. Now the question is, how does this look underground? Oh, that looks fine. Looks actually almost natural if it wasn't for the, for the uh, top of the, or the underground. That's, it looks pretty good, I think. I like it. All right, so what I'm wondering is, should we add um, more rocks under the under here? Okay. So let's see. I think what we'll do is go ahead and cover this ground oh, up with rocks. And but they these awesome rocks and the underwater like plants that they gave us in the aquatic pack is just super cool i love it and obviously in in an actual zoo they probably wouldn't have these although these are like the fake rocks they would probably use um let's hit v to get that to the surface um and then they would probably uh i saw one i don't know if it was I don't know what zoo it was, but it was either the zoo on Animal Planet or, like, Secret Life of the Zoo. I don't remember. But they had a penguin habitat where they would um, they would take all the penguins and move them to another area to be able to... Um, oh, I need nature. To be able to clean out their, their area. So it it was rock, but they all they had to do is empty it out of water and then um 
like just hose it down. Uh, so, I mean, they could possibly do that with this one, but <laughs> it, I don't know. Uh, let's see. Let's go to aquatic pack. All right. And these little um, uh, plants here, I just kind of like to bury them into the rock to make it look a little bit more like they were, you know, they've been growing in these rocks for a while, not just like placed here. <laughs> oh, nope, that's not what I want to do. Okay. And these are pretty cool. I don't know if these are made for the underwater, though. Um, I mean, I don't see why they couldn't be underwater plants, but they may be more for, for above water. <laughs> but I'm going to put one right here. Uh, the one problem with the seals, though, is to make sure that uh, they can still get around um, all the stuff that you place in here. Because that is definitely uh, an issue. So we'll go ahead and put a couple more of these around. And I like these little um, purple flowers. What were these? Um, I don't remember. Did I use a minute ago? They didn't have. Anyways. Uh, I like these little purple flowers. They're cool. Of course, I like purple and pink and that kind of thing. So. No, obviously, I like these, and right? And they have these darker ones um, that are pretty cool, too. Oh, stop it. That you can place around, I think. So let's do shift. And I can't tell what's going to be above ground and what's not. I think that looks pretty good. Just popping out of the ground. I think that looks cool, too. It is hard to tell until you have it uh, put down what it's going to look like. Uh, I want... Nope. <laughs> uh, bubbles. All right, let's see. Nope, that's smoke. That's not what I want. I want these. Uh, I'm going to have to play for this to show up. So I think what I'll do is put a bubble here, kind of close to where the food is. Oh. I like the bubble effects. That's super cool. I'm going to have to have to bring that down, though. So I, I want to um, hide these. Uh, let's go ahead and hit X. The only problem with hiding them is you can't find them again when you need them, if you need them, which is kind of annoying. But let's see. Where is that? We'll just put it down there. And let's, because I don't like these black things that uh, you have to look at. <clears throat> Let's put it down like that. Okay. I think that's looking pretty cool. I like it. I mean, it's not super overgrown, but I think it looks nice. All right. So um, let's see. What do we got here? Uh, research done. On the seals, awesome. And let's see, it looks like we've got everything. Well, we still have diseases. Let's go ahead, uh, Elos, you get on one of those. And we'll put all of these guys on a disease, just to get that done. And what do we got here? Gray seal, animal welfare has a track. Why? What is going on? Habitat, temperature, plants. Oh, you not like the plants? What's going on? Uh, let's see. I wasn't paying attention to that, but oh, they don't like the hyacinth or the palm tree. But I like that. <laughs> um, you know what? As long as the rest of the welfare is good, the plants shouldn't be an issue that's that's why I'm kind of kind of wondering like at least I thought that's what it was I mean that's what everybody says <laughs> everybody says as long as everything else is good the plants 
are fine. I mean, their overall welfare is 85. I, I don't want to take out anything. <laughs> Adult population is not as good as they would like. So let's go ahead and get, uh, not there, uh, animal trading. Okay, so unfortunately, we keep getting, I keep getting disconnected from the franchise servers. So I think that's where we're going to end for today. Um, I wanted to get a lot more stuff done, but we got some rocks uh, put in. We got our little, um, I guess, dock uh, done here, which is super cool. And yeah, so that's going to be it for this one. I hope you guys have enjoyed. Uh, if you have, definitely hit that thumbs up. Check all the links down below if you haven't already. Um, you can become a, a patron and get your name as a Planet Zoo staff member or animal of your choice. And uh, along with all kinds of other uh, awesome rewards. So check that out. And I'm hoping I can get back into the game. We'll see. But <laughs> until next time, I want to thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you have a super blessed day, and I will see you next time. Bye, guys.